Hey, what's up, guys? Today, I'm going to show you how to make um, Roblox clothes on your Chromebook. So, yeah, let's go. So, first, you want to go to pixlr.com, and you're going to want a photo template. And it's like, like Roblox shirt template. And let's go to this one. And then we're going to Actually, maybe not this one. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. Ooh, blurry. I think I have one saved already, so. Open image. You need to go down. I'm just gonna go down to where like the thing is. Oh, it might take a little bit of scrolling. So, okay, there you go. Open this up, and we're gonna make. I'm gonna make a SpongeBob shirt. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna go to yellow shirt. Just kind of so we get those like kind of wrinkles thing in. Yeah, like this. No. Yeah, no. This one. And just take a screenshot of it. Just to get a feel of a real shirt. And. And then we're gonna, and yeah, so we have this. I'm gonna shrink it down just a little bit. And what to do if it's too small, just go here to this little arrow things, arrange, have this like kind of highlighted. No. And click down here, duplicate. And it will duplicate your image. Let's do that again. And there you go. See, so yeah, it's looking pretty decent so far. And we're going to do it again. So just plastering it all over. Just put it all over, like, like the arms, the back, everything. So yeah, the duplicate, ring it down, duplicate, bring it down. There, and. We're going to keep doing this until we have the whole thing filled up. Actually, I'm not going to do a SpongeBob shirt. I'm just going to do... I don't know. I'm going to do an alien shirt. That's what I did. I already uploaded an alien shirt, but it kind of sucked. So, I might just do it again. If it's oversized, don't, don't really worry. It won't do anything, I don't think. It won't affect how your shirt will appear. So, I mean, it's wrapped around, so. No, we need that. And the top and the back. Do that. And we're just gonna put it all around until everything is there the way it's supposed to be
And thank you guys for the support. I've been getting tons of support lately. Thank you. And just, yeah, I just want to say thanks for supporting me. And yeah. I appreciate you all. And we get it here. Duplicate it. Put it up here. And then, I'm going to duplicate this. Then bring it like that. Duplicate it. And duplicate it. This is what we're just going to keep doing until everything is there. Oh, wait. It moved. There. It might appear a little wonky and like when it's in the avatar shot, but it still works as a really good shirt. And I think you can only make like long sleeve shirts on this. Because I tried making a short sleeve shirt and it just had white things coming down my arm when I tried when I uploaded it. So yeah, it's really good. It's not it wasn't that great. So that's why I recommend long sleeve. Like so, and we're gonna fill up the rest of these. So yeah, let's just hurry up. I don't know how much time I have left on my screen recorder. Speed run this. Get it good. And we shall do it. Like, sorry, like, I'm on like a screen for where I don't know if I can really edit. So yeah, it's just. And I was so close to passing my friend in subscriber count. So I have 12, he is 13. And so I think we will be able to pass him in over the next week or so. I mean, it's not a lot of subscribers, so. Bye. I really hope I can, because they're like, oh, I have more subscribers. There you go. Nice. You might see a little shading here, but it won't matter. So just keep cool. And just use it. There we go, we're doing pretty good. And I might not put something on it. I don't know. There are better photo editors. I don't think it really matters which one you use. 
I just use this one because I'm going to do some research and find one that's better than this. Because this is, I mean, this is good. But not, like, good enough for, like, what I really try to use it for. Like, I do, I do like it for making thumbnails and stuff, so. Yeah, I'll teach you how to make thumbnails. Yeah, here's our shirt. And we're just going to add an image to it. Alice Alien. Make sure it's transparent too, like this. It's really annoying when I'm trying to find transparent stuff. And this is better because, and other things are better, I think, just because you can make them transparent if you want to. So, yeah, here's our alien shirt. And all I gotta do is save that. Download. One pose and go to roblox.com. Create, go to shirts. Oh, frick! The heck, what was that? I have no idea what that was. So, yeah, go to not t shirts. How do I keep screwing this up? How oh, I'm making the the thing go ham. So, and choose file. Do your shirt. Name it. Yellow. And upload it. This is how to sell it. So, configure. And add a description. Save it. Sales. You can open that up for sales. And let's say the price is seven. You can save that. And you wait for it to get the okay. So that was how to create shirts on roblox if you did enjoy please like subscribe and turn on that notification bell and i'll see you in the next 